I got the vest on, bad bitch loading. 15 bands on me, that's bad bitch lotion. I bought cities, but not ask you bitches, ask enough. Never silly, I'm in your city if you whacking up. I guess you'll see it as it goes behind me. Hello there. That's Shantae. <laughs> I just saw a lizard, bitch. I just saw a goddamn lizard. This is the courtyard. This is where I will be running my lines. Damn, I still hear the laundry, so that means it's not done yet. Okay. No, 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 go ahead. That's my stuff in the dryer. <laughs> Check. Hold on. Roll the fire. Shit is real. Okay. I don't know if you've seen Shantae when I pointed it up, but that's one of the producers on the show. She's amazing. She is like Cayenne Senior. She down for the bullshit so long as the work is done. So she's really dope. But, um... July 28th, I seen a shooting star literally two month, two, two days over a month. I'm out here doing this. Y'all can't tell me he ain't real. You better get the known. <laughs> they sent me the script at literally 3 a.m. And I text my cousin at 3 a.m. And I said, could you do me a favor and come over here tomorrow and record me do this audition so I can send it in, please? And she has something to do, but she was like, all right, I'm going to make it work. So shout out to my cousin Shantora. <laughs> she is a part of my journey as an actress. <laughs> I'm never going to forget this. I was up 3 a.m. running them lines, running them lines. She came over at like 4 o'clock p.m. the next day, even though the motherfucker was supposed to be there. <laughs> at, no, no, no. Matter of fact, matter of fact, she came at like 1, 2. And we really started to get into a groove around 4 o'clock. We sent that shit at 5 o'clock. They offered the job at 6.15. The next day, I was supposed to fly out at 10 p.m. Then they called me. It was like, Cayenne, you need to leave like at night, right? That's that's like the earliest you could leave. And I was like, yeah. They was like, okay, because there's like a 7 p.m. You know, if you can't make it, you know, we, we may have to recast. <laughs> you you got to... Uh, hold on. Let me throw some drawers in the bag. <laughs> for double cross this is day two of me living the life of an actress um since i've been down here i've eaten nothing but fruit i had an enchilada and it was weird it was very weird um i had the tortilla with the chicken rolled up and had the sauce on the outside and the cheese on the outside. That was weird. But I ate it. I probably wouldn't do it again. Um, that's what's helping me stay on my fruit diet. Um, oh, I was looking for my water and my phone is propped up by it. Like, hey, water, you are so helpful. Keep me hydrated. Keep me minding my business. And you hold my phone. Mm, okay, bestie. Uh, but one thing I am surprised about is this motherfucking brain. Because when they give me words, I go in the room and it just like melt into my brain. Like, you know what I think it is? I, I feel like I'm similar to my character, Imani, in regards to her assertion and her need, her want, her desire to be respected. It's like, hey, I was dealt the short end of the stick, so I'm pretty much demanding you follow my lead. Um... I mean, the only, the only thing about this right now is my face. I still got this pudginess um, from the surgery that I had last week. Still got the stitches in. Right. <laughs> Other than that, I really don't have any discomfort. I'm comfortable where I'm at. I'm grateful for where I'm at. And I can't wait to see where I go next.
Okay. Lunch time. Okay, so I just wrapped one of my scenes. Well, I don't know if he wrapped or not. But a bitch finna eat, y'all. I'm finna eat. Like, isn't it weird seeing Amani in Cayenne's element? Because Amani is a devious bitch and I'm hungry. That's who I am. So it is now day eight. <laughs> That's how fast this shit has been going. I'm on my way to my dressing room now. I can show you my name because <laughs> everyone knows who I am, darling. <laughs> I'm getting to know Imani a lot more than what I felt I knew her. Uh, she was dealt the short end of the stick and she's just coming for the rest of everything that she feels is hers. So I'm like, I'm like in my little, my little groove. I'm, my, my nerves are settling. Um, I smoked Cali weed literally like this. <laughs> Thank you. Like that. And that was it. Yeah, I'm gonna go out with my lines until the fucking sun comes up because I can't sleep. 